The basic concept in fiscal theory of the price level, where does inflation come from? And the answer is that it comes really from the overall quantity of government debt relative to how much people think the government will pay off that debt. So it works very much like stocks. With stock worth, well, there's how many shares and there's how many dividends you think the company's going to pay for those shares. Kind of divide it, you get the stock price. Same concept. And intuitively, why? Well, I suppose we're sitting on, oh, $30 trillion of government debt. We look around and we say, you know, our government might be good for $20 trillion but they're not going to be able to pay off 30 trillion. So what do you do? Well, you try to get rid of your government debt quick before the value falls, right? And so individually we can. Uh, I can sell it to you. You can try to sell it to someone else. But collectively we can't. To try to get rid of it, we got to end up buying stuff. Well, there's only so much stuff to go around. So as we try to get rid of government debt overall, we drive up the price level. As the price level goes up, as inflation eats away at the value of that debt, it's worth 20 trillion in old money once the inflation has gone up.